Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone, man. Happy Black Friday and happy late Thanksgiving for anybody in the States who celebrates that holiday. But yeah, welcome to my Friday, or sorry, my Black Friday deals stream. So that's what we're doing today. That's what we're going to be talking about, all the latest deals. But just a quick heads up, a portion of my Black Friday deals video is brought to you by tribit and their stormbox flow speaker check them out at the links in the video description but more about this speaker later on in this video so just want to send a quick shout out to all of my people who showed up super super early if you're catching this on replay the people that i'm going to be talking to are my people in my live audience so i am recording this live in front of them so we're just doing this all on the go let me get this box out of here though let's go that out of the way <laughs> so we got we got everything else we need but just want to give a quick shout out to my people that came in early mr gary came in super early what's up brother good to see you man i appreciate you coming in my c prince kino crescendo my girl kimmy came through early tb what's up we got malte in the house vml what's up man how's it going how's it going good to see everybody coming through appreciate you guys javier what's up man brian hurt rob nitro what's up man we got michael what up bro how you guys doing good to see you good to see you billy mary what's going on guys good to see everybody here happy to see everybody here can't say that enough but yeah man so that's what we're doing today so i've got it broken down we're gonna do this a little bit differently because usually what i would do with the like black friday cyber monday like these types of streams is i would just kind of put all the brands together and talk about them one by one this time i actually decided to make it a little bit easier for you as you're shopping to kind of break things down by price so i'm going to talk about the best deals under 30 the best deals under 50 the best deals under 100 the best deals under 200 and then everything above 200 bucks so that's how we're going to kind of go through this so that's that's where we're going to start man so we're going to start at the earbuds under 30 dollars so i want to start this off just like that so best earbuds under 30 bucks so let me see here double check real quick make sure the camera is working hey good to see you see you hank how you doing man muhammad what's going on good to see you jeff hale blessings to you too aaron miller what's up man good to see you guys all right so let's see here just double check and make sure camera is working all right cool all right so let's go man hey good to see you ricardo good to see you man uh, so first up First up, we're going to be looking at the, well, actually, hold on. Let me double check and make sure my thing is working here. Hold on. <laughs> I just want to make sure like my screens are all up and where they need to be. All right. There, there it is. Okay. Just making sure. All right. So first ones that we're looking at here now, mind you, there's a ton of deals. So we kind of got to go through them, you know, while we can. So, <laughs> yo, this is a funny comment right here. I didn't know he streams. I literally stream every week. <laughs> I actually stream more now then I actually drop regular videos just to be clear so yeah you got to turn on that that you got to subscribe and hit that notification bell man for real for real for real <laughs> all right here we go here we go all right so let me bring these up so the very first one is going to be uh the oneplus nord buds 2 so you can see i've got them up here on amazon 50 percent off right now going for 29.99 for the white version for some reason it looks like the gray version might not be at a discount or they've already sold out but considering the fact that they are 29 bucks for a set of one plus nord buds 2 these things are fantastic so let me go ahead and bring up camera two here real quick boom and i've actually got them right here let me see if it'll focus up come on there you go all right focus up here there we are <laughs> <laughs> so yeah oneplus you guys know i've been talking about oneplus earbuds especially the oneplus buds pro 2 for months ad nauseum you know ad nauseum one of my top favorite earbuds and these are excellent like they're one of the better options under 50 bucks but the fact that you can get them for under 30 excellent excellent overall so these are a bass heads earbud so if you like bass in your music these are going to be excellent for what you need um, and if you're using a oneplus device or a nord device these are going to be the perfect earbuds to match up with your device so they've got you covered there so yeah overall very very good excellent battery life on these guys excellent sound excellent nice strong bass with them as well you know pretty decent latency as well so if you want to use it for gaming you're going to be fine not going to be any issues there whatsoever so but yeah these are definitely serious man they've got 12.4 millimeter drivers so big big drivers on these guys excellent overall seven hours continuous playback with just the earbuds themselves 36 total hours with the case and in addition to that they also added active noise cancellation to these guys so overall they are very very good man so yeah these are the one plus nord buds 2 and as i was showing you just a second ago they are available on amazon right here 
for $29.99. There are links to all of the, all, of, all the earbuds I'm gonna be talking about today. They're all gonna have links in the video description. So if you wanna check any of them out, all the deals are gonna be right there for you. Hey, what's up, BJ Perry? Good to see you, bro. Appreciate you coming through. Appreciate you coming through. But yeah, so that's that's the first one, man. So let's get that one out of the way. That was the OnePlus Nord Buds 2. So let me, sorry, I'm just trying to move these over. Bam, there we go. Good Lord, all right. <laughs> <laughs> all right so what's next here let's see somehow i got all these all of these backwards there we go all right so the next one is i haven't seen too many people talk about these i think these kind of might have just dropped recently and maybe that's why i haven't seen like a lot of people or, or even like a lot of videos about these but i picked them up recently and they're actually surprisingly good and I think they normally run around 35 to 40 bucks, but right now they've got them for 29 for Black Friday. So let me go ahead and bring them up here real quick, see if I can get, them to get it to focus. There it goes. All right. So these guys right here, these are the Tozo T20, and these have one of those cases that actually show you the battery life. So on camera, because of the, uh, the, uh, <laughs> because of the way the camera works, it's kind of showing all weird, but normally it just reads the battery life. So that's usually how it works. Um, but right now, I think, what is it reading? Hold on. So right now it's reading 81%. So that's what it's got, 81% battery. It also shows you the battery levels of each earbud individually, but that's what we got there. So let me go ahead and bring these up and boom. All right, Tozo T20, these guys right here. So check them out, $29.99, overall pretty good. Dual mic ENC noise canceling for phone calls. So you got some pretty serious battery life on these guys as well. Wireless charging, USB-C as well, 10 mil drivers. Now, if you're familiar with Tozo earbuds, Tozo earbuds get dummy loud and they got some serious thumb to them. So if you haven't used any of the Tozo earbuds, um, then you might not be familiar, but for people who really need like truly loud earbuds, which I don't recommend listening to earbuds at full volume, but if you really need loud earbuds, Tozo are usually one of the better ones to go with if that's what you need. And consider right now that they are under, uh, coming in for under 30 bucks, this is gonna be one of the better deals at this price point. So yeah, Tozo T20s, very, very impressed with these when I got them in, I was like, okay, these are pretty good. These are pretty good, so not bad overall. But yeah, for anybody who might be checking them out, these are pretty dope for what they are, especially considering that low, low price tag. So not bad, right? Overall, pretty good. But yeah, $29.99 early Black Friday deal, or actually Black Friday deal now. But yeah, so we've got those. Those are the Tozo T20. So yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, YouTube's been slacking on notifications. Hey, I, I hear you, man. That's the truth right there. Sometimes it happens, man. Sometimes it happens. But it's cool either way, man. Either way. So uh, JGD, I'm not really talking about wired options in the stream today. So yeah, I mean, it's, I just don't... I'm not the channel that people come to for wired options. So that's, that's the thing. There's plenty of other people that are doing that stuff. So I'm just going to stick to the wireless stuff, at least for this stream. Um, all right, so next one we've got, um, and we can't do a, a under 30 list like this without including, um, hold on, let me, let me close that one out. We gotta bring up the other one here. All right, there they are, boom. All right, so we can't do this without bringing up these guys right here. And they're actually even, yeah, they're, they're, it looks like they've got a lightning deal going on right now as well, but let me bring them up. So we've got the Soundcore A20i, also known as the Anchor A20i going for 20 bucks so overall very very good set of earbuds i do have a full video on these on my channel as well for anybody who's interested in checking them out one of the better options under 30 bucks in my personal opinion so let me go ahead and bring them up so i've got them right here these are the soundcore a20i so check them out nice small earbuds i got my spin fit tips on them already so we've got that already covered, but yeah, overall very good. Now these are not noise canceling earbuds. These are just gonna be for, you know, for sound, listening to, you know, watching your videos, listening to music, stuff of that nature. You do get Soundcore app access. So you get, you know, you can customize all of the EQs, you get all the presets and all of that stuff. So overall, very, very good for what they are, especially for the value of these earbuds. So yeah, considering the price, these are actually pretty excellent in my opinion. And like I said, I have a whole video. If you want the whole rundown, if you wanna hear mic samples, if you wanna you know, see how they compare to other earbuds at this price point, make sure you check out the full review. I do have that on my channel for anybody who's interested. Let me pop that over. So if you go in here, you go to live, and where is it at? You scroll down right here, Soundcore A20i. So full video on this product right here. So for anybody who might be interested, that's where you will find that. But yeah, so overall a nice solid product coming in from Soundcore, especially at such a low price, if you ask me. 
So yeah, and they also come in three different colors. By the way, I forgot to mention that. Um, so they do have them in the the standard black. They have them in standard white, and then they have them in like with a white case with like a purple earbud, which is kind of a trip. But yeah, so so they do have them in a couple of different color options. But yeah, those are the Soundcore uh, A twenty I. All right, so let's see here. Hey, Jojo, good to see you. Appreciate you coming in. Popeye's in the house. What's up, man? Good to see you. Good to see you. Appreciate you. Said the Tozo NC7s are the basiest earbuds. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're yeah, they're seriously, seriously bassy. Sam Foster's in the house. What's up, man? Doing all right. Doing all right. Just tired. Just tired. Got a video out earlier that uh, not many people watched. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what kept me up. So for people that aren't aware, because I know how YouTube is sometimes, man. I know how YouTube can be. So if you guys didn't know, I did drop a video this morning right here on the Poly Voyager Free 60 Plus UC. So these are teleconferencing earbuds. Some people may not be interested interested in these. Um, really a business-focused earbud. So, you know, for taking Zoom calls, uh, Microsoft Teams, like that sort of stuff. Very, very work-focused earbuds. There is a Black Friday on them right now. I think they're like 239 but for anybody who might have missed that, I did drop a video this morning. So I <laughs> just wanted to throw that out there because that video got skipped by everyone. <laughs> so, yeah, man. Hey, John Wick, what's up, man? Good to see you. Hey, no worries, Jojo. You're never late. You're right on time. Evan, what's up, bro? Good to see you, man. SpinFits for OnePlus uh, Buds Pro 2. You want to use SpinFit CP1025. So, and whenever you have questions like that, like in my reviews, so here, let me, let me show you guys something. I want to show you guys something because people will literally be in the video and will ask me stuff like, oh, hey, what spin fits for this model? And I'm like, bro, it's, it, I, I, I do this on purpose. So when you go into the, into the, which, you know, the, the earbuds, like which ones to get or whatnot, I'll put which spin fits work for them right here. Like I'll, I'll drop that in there. So this is on the OnePlus Buds Pro 2 video right here. There's a spin fit CP 1025s. So I'll do that on purpose on almost every single video just to make sure that you guys know like which ones to get. So I try, I, I do, I promise I try to make it as easy as possible for you guys to know which, uh, which earbuds to get. Hey, Kimmy, good to see you. Hawks, good to see you. Hey, Huggable Hipsters in the house. Good to see you. Appreciate you coming through. Hope you're having a good day. All right. So yeah. All right. So let me back up out of here. All right. So uh, let me close that one out. So next one is actually a newer product. Um, and this is going to be the first time that I'm going to be showing them on my channel. But it is a newer product. You've probably seen it on my boy Gameski's channel, probably other people's channels as well. So let me go ahead and bring them up here. Uh, where is it at? Ah, here it is. Okay. So these ones right here, another excellent, excellent deal are the Soundpeats Clear. So these are the Soundpeats Clear right now going for... $19.99, so $10 off right now, 33% off. They are available in multiple colors, but it looks like it's only the black ones that are on sale right now. So let me go ahead and show them, show them to you. I do have them right here. I've been trying these out for a few days and these are excellent earbuds. I was actually quite impressed what they're doing. Well, I mean, it's Soundpeat, so obviously they're gonna bring that thump and that volume. So overall, very, very good. And now we have two options from Soundpeats under 30 bucks that serve two different sound preferences. So, because they also have the free two classics, which I'll talk about in a sec. Those are more, more balanced sound. These are more for the bass heads. And these are excellent for that. They definitely deliver that thump. And coming in for such a low price, coming in right now at 19 bucks, really tough to beat, really tough to beat. So overall, very good. You, now these don't have noise cancellation, nothing like that. So these are for making phone calls, watching videos. They do have a low latency gaming mode. They are IPX4 rated. So overall, very, very good. So yeah, I'm, I'm actually I'm actually quite impressed with them. I, I didn't think they were going to be as good as they were. I was like, because, you know, basically the, the free two classics set the bar kind of high for the under $30 price point. But these are like a different flavor, essentially. So these are a base head version of that. So yeah, so that's what we got there from uh, from Soundpeats under 30. And let's bring up another one here really quick. Now, this is something that I was not expecting to see under 30 bucks, or at least not a brand that I was expecting to see for under 30 bucks. And what we have here are the JBL Vibe Beam. So these are coming in for 30 bucks. Normally these are $50 earbuds from JBL, but their black version are selling for 30 bucks so i've got those right here these are the jbl right here the vibe beam these are stem style earbuds 
So just so you can see, these do get access to JBL's app as well. So you're getting app support on these guys, but overall a very, very good set of earbuds, definitely bass head certified. So my guy LaShawn will be super happy trying these out. I don't think he's in the chat today. I think he's avoiding me today or something. I don't know what's going on with him, but <laughs> nonetheless, these are bass head certified. So if anybody has tried um, JBL products, you guys already know that they deliver that thump. These also have um, IP54 certified earbuds. So overall dust and water resistance is very good on these guys as well. And coming in for that low price, 29 bucks, 40% off, really, really tough to beat these earbuds at this price point. So yeah, so basically what I just did there is I rattled off five really good base head options for true wireless earbuds under 30 bucks. I'm gonna give you two additional options right now for earbuds that are going to be um, not necessarily for bass heads, but more for if you prefer something that sounds a little bit more balanced, something with more refined tuning, if you will. So let me go ahead and bring these up really quick. All right, especially since they're, they're on sale, that, that I was really, really pumped to see that, uh, that they're actually, <laughs> you know, they've got a nice discount on them right now. So yeah, good to see you, man. Um, let's see here. All right. Uh, new here, watched your videos to decide what earbuds to get on BF. Uh, chose Liberty Pro. Nice. Got them for 47 on eBay. Anchor store refurbished. Nice. Excellent, man. That's a good deal, man. Good to see that. Yo, Hokago Tea Time. What's up, man? Good to see you. Appreciate you uh, sliding by. <laughs> Lashana somewhere smoking. That's what I figured. That's what I figured. <laughs> But yeah, so let me bring up the first of these two, and that is going to be the Moondrop Space Travel. So these are in black. They are also available in a white version. I'll show you the white version in just a sec. They are normally about 25 to 30 bucks. Right now, 15% off coming in at $21. And overall, a very, very, very good sounding set of True Wireless earbuds coming from my friends at Moondrop. So very, very good overall. You do get app support. Their app is not the best, but you do get some app support. But overall, the sound quality and the tuning on these is from Moondrop. And they are, you know, the makers of some excellent headphones and some excellent in-ear monitors. So their tuning tends to trickle down into their True Wireless earbuds as well. Mm -hmm. And I've got them right here. So here are the Moondrop Space Travel. Like I said, I've got the white version here. I actually took my um, my spin fit tips off of them to put them on a different set of earbuds. But yeah, that's them right there. So let me go ahead and pop these out real quick. Boom. So you can see stem style, touch controls, full featured earbuds. Whoop. Oh, hello. <laughs> Just bouncing all over the place on me. But there we go. Back in the case. There we are. But that's them right there. These are the Moondrop Space travel and they do offer like these other like uh cases to go over them and stuff as well you can actually pick those up i think it's on shenzhen audio or on uh, linsole audio's website or maybe hi-fi go one of the others but yeah so overall a good choice if you want something under 30 bucks that's going to deliver better cleaner tuning that's going to be a good option for you now second to that second to the space travel is going to be the sound Pete's free to classic i've been talking about these for probably well over a year now these are excellent excellent earbuds for what they deliver very very balanced tuning no noise cancellation none of the advanced features just good sound quality and good battery life out of these guys so both of these coming in pretty low price let me see what, what we got on the free two classics right now let's double check here ah not bad so about 22 bucks on the free two classics right now you can also add an additional 10 percent coupon right there so yeah, so you can kind of get a nice little, uh, nice little price drop on these guys. So yeah, not bad overall, not bad. So yeah, definitely worth checking out. But those are the two, uh, what I would call the more balanced options were the previous five were very, very much base, you know, base centric, very base head. But these two right here are going to be more for those of you who have, you know, more refined taste. So that's what it's going to be there. But yeah, so those are our options under 30 bucks. All right, so let me close that out real quick. All right, and then we're going to move into the $50 section. Hey, David, good to see you, man. Appreciate you coming in. Appreciate you coming in. <laughs> it's only here, 2.30 a.m. Hey, I appreciate you stopping by and hanging with us, though, man. <laughs> Said, have posted a video about that. I believe the Samsung Galaxy Buds Pro 2 spin fit adapters will work on Liberty 4 NC. Yeah, so it's, it's the Galaxy Buds Pro um, spin fits. They come with... Um, CP1025 
and uh, SpinFit's CPA2 adapters because you have to use adapters for SpinFit earbuds to work on the Liberty 4 NCs uh, because, you know, S uh, Soundcore, for some reason, decided that they wanted to start using plastic clips on their ear tips. Uh, bro. <laughs> if I meet the engineer who made that executive decision, I'm going to cuss him out. So... <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah. So you got to watch out for that, man. You got to watch out for that. Let's see here. All right. So where are we at here? All right. Okay. And. Okay. Let me catch up. Yo, Trenton. What's up, man? Good to see you, bro. Appreciate you coming in. All right. All right, Gigi. I think I, I I think I just got you in. Uh, I think I just wrenched you up. So if you wanna if you wanna take care of business while you're here, I appreciate it. But trust me, you're, there's no responsibility. You don't have to stay. It's all good. But I got you. But yeah, and trends here too. So yeah. All right. So now we're gonna move into the fifty dollars section. And with the fifty dollars section, we're gonna start with easily one of the better options in under one hundred dollars. I would say, but under fifty, it's an absolute steal, in my personal opinion. And that is going to be the Edifier TWS-1 Pro 2. So coming in at 43% off right now on Amazon for all three colors. You can get these in black, you can get these in baby blue, and you can get them in white. So you have all three options. These earbuds are absolutely excellent. Excellent earbuds, full featured deep noise cancellation, enhanced mics, in-ear detection, fast charging, low latency mode, customizable EQs, app support, Bluetooth 5.3. I mean, they really deliver on the features and Edifier, you know what I mean? It's, they, they, they usually come through with a heavy punch, which I really, really like. So overall, very, very good earbuds. I'm actually truly, truly impressed with these guys. Um, but yeah, so let me go ahead and bring them up. So I've got mine right here, but yeah, let's do that really quick here. Boom, so yeah. These are the Edifier TWS-1 Pro 2. And if you guys remember, the original, the, the original TWS-1 Pro were my top earbuds under 50 for over a year. Like, they were seriously, seriously good earbuds. Sound quality on those rivaled anything at any price. Like, they were so well-tuned. As, uh, as you can see, I've got my CP1025 spin fits on here already. Uh, also, I also included links to all the spin fit tips in the video description for this stream as well. So if anybody's interested in that. But yeah, these are excellent, excellent earbuds. I was truly, truly impressed with how uh, how these sound and how strong the noise cancellation is. It's very, very impressive. Um, but yeah, overall, really, really good earbuds for anybody who's looking for something at this price point. Um, if you're in the um, sub 50 right now, um, for me, these are the top choice. So if you have 50 bucks to spend, this would be where I would spend it. I would spend it on the Edifier TWS-1 Pro 2. Now we have other options, obviously under 50 bucks, which I'll talk about right now, but that would be my number one choice right now for under 50. Yo, R-Dub, what up, man? Good to see you, appreciate you coming through. Appreciate you coming through. Let's see, uh, all right. I'm not as heavy with earbuds, but they just keep getting more and more cyberpunk. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, they're, they're actually very clean. They do have strong bass, but they're actually very clean sounding earbuds. So yeah, overall, very, very good. Uh, I, wouldn't be able to, I wouldn't be able to tell you the decibel levels off the top of my head. I, I don't have those kind of notes for a stream like this. So yeah, I don't, I, I don't have all of the minutia right now. And I, and I don't remember that stuff off the top of my head, man. <laughs> they're they're loud <laughs> for sure so if i if i'm trying to remember correctly i believe they were somewhere in the 113 decibel to like 117 decibel range so because i don't remember them being like oh my god these are really quiet which they're not and oh my god these are the loudest earbuds i've ever heard that wasn't that either so yeah so that's what it is let's see here all right <clears throat> Let's see. All right. So that was that one. Who do we have next? Ah, got it. Where, now, where are they? Ah, here we are. All right. So these just made an appearance on my, um, the video that I dropped just, just, uh, what was it? Just a couple of days ago, really? Actually, just earlier this week. What am I thinking? <laughs> it was literally, 
<laughs> it was literally on Monday. I'm like, wait, when did I when did I do this? Boom, right here. So the top five under 100. So these earbuds right here just made an appearance on that list. So <laughs> I'm like, wait, what? When did they show? When did I do that stream? That's that's the, that's how tired I am. Let me show you how tired I am. I can't remember half the things that are going on right now. Um, but yeah, so they made their debut in that video. It's these guys right here. These, these sound Pete's air Four pro. Now, mind you, they are 51 99, but you can also apply another 8% off. So that'll definitely get you under the $50 mark. They are available in three different colors. You got them in black, you've got them in white and you've got them in beige. Um, so I've actually got them in black right here. So these are the sound Pete's air Four pro boom right there i've got my spin fit omni tips on these guys and yeah these took the number two spot in my under 100 category these are overall super super good earbuds very very nice overall features sound i mean these are featuring one of the latest uh, qualcomm chips so you got snapdragon sound aptex lossless on compatible devices so overall a great set of earbuds nice strong noise cancellation as well the downside of these now they're not all perfect the downside of these is that the call quality needs work sound Pete's needs to work on these microphones because the call quality is a little sus so it's a little sus but these are very very good earbuds overall so i'm truly impressed definitely bass head certified 100 percent. so if anybody's looking at the uh sound Pete's, Air 4 Pro, these are very, very good earbuds. But yeah, so yeah, see right here, a Snapdragon Qualcomm Aptex Adaptive, CD, uh, C <laughs> CD quality lossless audio. So yeah, but yeah, overall, very, very good. But like, yeah, they these mics though, they need a little bit of work. So <laughs> just gotta keep it real, man. We gotta keep it real. So I wouldn't buy these phone calls. I'd buy these for music and for gaming and for watching videos. So yeah, just keeping it real, man. Yo, Barry, what up, man? Good to see you, bro. Appreciate you coming through. Man, listening from Dubai. Good God. What's up, man? Appreciate you coming through. Which spin fit should I use on my OnePlus Buds Pro 2? CP1025, sir. That's for Sunny Boy. What's up, man? Good to see you. Appreciate you. Let's see here. Uh, days just flying by for all of us man it's crazy out here bro it is crazy i'm telling you man <laughs> I, I don't know how i'm doing it to be completely honest let me take a quick sip here good to see barry in the chat though appreciate you sliding by all right all right there we go okay all right, so let's move into the next one. So got that one out of the way. Where is the next one? Ah, here we are. Yeah, we definitely can't do a stream without talking about these guys right here, man. So I've been talking about these for days, <laughs> for a long, long time, for a long time. So it looks like they got a early, well, they got a Black Friday deal, but there's also a Lightning deal going on in these guys. But these are the Soundcore life a three i so right now going for 34.98 available in two colors you can get them in black or you can get them in white these things are excellent earbuds like ever since they dropped like these were weren't like a major release from soundcore um these kind of flew under the radar like i just like somebody had mentioned them to me i think in a comment and i was like what what's that and i ended up ordering them and had no idea that these released and they are were fantastic like the sound the volume uh, the noise cancellation on them, the call quality, the bass, the bass response on these guys, um, the ability to do all the custom preset EQs. I was truly, truly surprised and impressed with the Life A3i. Um, still, and for a long time, one of the very best options you can get under 50 bucks. They remain so. Like, that's why I'm including them here is because they're still one of the best options, even though they've been out for probably over a year at this point. But yeah. So I've got mine right here, and they're known under two names. You can get them under the Life A3i or the Life Dot 3i. So that's just something that Soundcore uh, will do. They'll kind of slightly change the name on the earbud so that they can sell them in big box stores like Walmart and uh, Target, you know, places like that. So, but yeah, so that's why you'll see some of the same earbuds under two names. That's what's going on there. And these actually use button controls as well. So if you're not a fan of touch controls, you do have button controls on these. So they're super responsive, very tactile. These are low profile earbuds. So when they sit in your ear, they don't protrude a ton. Well, if you have larger ears like mine, that's the case. I guess if you have small ears, it might protrude a little bit. But yeah, just throwing that out there. 
So one of the better deals right now under 50 bucks is the Soundcore Life A3i. We can definitely not have this kind of a stream without talking about these earbuds. So definitely wanted to make sure that we brought these to the forefront, but yeah. So that's the Soundcore Life A3i. Now, another one, let me go ahead and move into the next one here really quick. Uh, bring those up. All right, where are we at? Okay. Here we go. All right, here we go. <clears throat> uh, yeah. All right, so the next one up we've got here are the One More Piston Buds Pro coming in at 30 two bucks right now overall very good looks like if you get them in white you can actually get them for as low as 29 bucks interesting under 30 i guess they must have just dropped the price because an hour or so ago these weren't 30 dollars. So, <laughs> so i was like wait a minute so yeah so 32 bucks or 29 bucks depending on which color you go with piston buds pro these are full featured earbuds you get app support you get noise cancellation transparency mode excellent sound there's no reason why uh you know an earbud under 50 dollars should have noise cancellation this strong but they definitely definitely bring it from our friends over at one more these are actually pretty small earbuds as well they don't they, they stick out a little bit but they're nowhere near as big as some of the other earbuds on the market so overall very compact size got my spin fit cp 1025s on them as well so overall very very good for what they do so yeah 32 bucks really tough to beat. one of the better deals coming from our friends at one more i was very very surprised to see these for such a low price but here we are so overall a nice nice set of earbuds for that low price but yeah so we've got those there and once again there's links the whole list of the of the earbuds that i'm going to be talking about in here and headphones that i'm going to be talking about they're all in the video description so I'm, i'll show you guys just in case because some people like have no idea what i when i say hey all these links are in the video description and they're just like i don't know what is he talking about what is the video description so right here this is the video description so you see the video right here you scroll down you see right here you hit more boom look the whole list bam all of it <laughs> the whole thing is right there so if anybody's looking for any of these definitely check those out clicking those links those are all affiliate links so just to be very clear they are amazon associate affiliate links which means that i do get a i do earn some uh, some revenue by you guys purchasing but it's at no additional cost to you so it doesn't cost you anything to use those links you can use them you cannot use them either way i appreciate it it does help support the channel and you guys know what supports the channel. I do give back to the community. This is actually what I did yesterday. So for people who aren't aware, I want to I'm talk about it here just really, really quick. So bear with me. Um, so when people do donations and super chats on my channel, um, <clears throat> a couple times a year, I will take all of your super chats like I did here, which is super chats right here, $441 in super chat donations from July 16th of this year until November 22nd. So that was on Wednesday. All that was all the super chats, 441. So I rounded it up to 500 and I made a thousand dollar donation to the Alameda County Community Food Bank. See, dear Heifer, uh, Heifer Reviews, thank you for your gift of 1,030. 1,030, the extra $30 is to cover their fees. Here's the beauty of it and why I waited because right now there's a group of angel investors that are matching everyone's donations to the food bank. So basically, my thousand dollars is now $2,000. So that's why I wanted to wait to make sure that our dollars stretch as far as possible. This is my community tab. So basically, if anybody wants to help, there's a link there if you want to help to the uh, help donate to the Alameda County Community Food Bank. So a lot of people don't realize this, but after, um, uh, it was just a couple of months back when the federal government decided that they were going to pull all of the additional emergency funding to the food banks that was given to them during um, during the pandemic. So now they kind of left them high and dry. So they need our help more than ever before. So just, you know, wanted to give that a quick shout out that that's what I do when you guys send donations, when you guys buy any of my merchandise, I put it back into my community here locally. So I just want to say thank you to everybody for helping me make that possible. I wouldn't be able to do that without your donations and your support. So it's greatly appreciated. Um, but yeah, so let's get, let's jump back in to these deals. Let me see, where did I leave off? Uh, that was Piston Buzz Pro. All right. So really quick, what I'm going to talk about here is I'm going to bring these up here. Just give me a sec while I open up some of these links, because we're going to talk about some uh, some headphones, not earbuds, but some headphone deals for uh, under 50 bucks that I definitely want to make sure we shout out because I know there's people who 
who want headphones, not just earbuds. Like I know, I know that's a th that's a thing. <laughs> headphones are a thing. So I want to talk about some wireless headphones that come in for the low, low prices. So let's start here at one of the better deals, at least in my personal opinion. Um, let's go right back to Chrome. So boom, there we go. All right. So first up, we've got the Soundcord Life Q20 Plus. So these originally the Q20 dropped a long time ago and they use like micro USB and like all that stuff. So the Q20 Plus, if I remember correctly, these are the ones where they actually upgraded them to use uh, to charge via USB-C. They have multi-point, they upgraded the drivers, they upgraded the chipset inside of them. Um, so overall, very good. 40 hours worth of playback time, high-res certified. So overall, a very, very good set of headphones and probably the best headphones you can get from Soundcore right now for under 50 bucks. So definitely something to keep in mind. If you're looking for gifts, if you're trying to find some, you know, some gift ideas that aren't gonna break the bank as far as headphones go, this is gonna be a very good set of headphones. So that's the first one second one is the sony ch520 these are on ear headphones not over ear so these will sit on your ears i do have these these are actually surprisingly good for 38 bucks the sound quality of these sony's i was very very impressed very very impressed with the sound quality of these guys and they're also easily the lightest headphones that I've used in a long time. Like I didn't think headphones could get much lighter. These are very lightweight. I was truly, truly surprised by that. So 38 bucks, these are the Sony WH-CH520. And then next we've got uh, the first one here from JBL. These are noise canceling on-ear headphones from JBL at 49 bucks, the JBL Tune 660NC. Another very, very, very solid option for a set of on-ear. But if you don't need noise cancellation and you don't like on-ear, you want something over-ear, they also have the JBL Tune 710. Now these have long battery life, but they don't have noise cancellation, but these are on-ear. And these are definitely a good set of headphones for their price tag. I was actually truly, truly impressed with these guys right here. So those are four, I believe, really, really solid options for headphones under 50 bucks right now, you got the JBL Tune 710BT, the JBL Tune 660NC, the Sony WH-CH520, and the Soundcore Life Q20 Plus. Don't get fooled, there's like a Live Q20. Don't get that one, get the Q20 Plus. Make sure you get the upgraded version. Don't, don't get the older version. <laughs> don't mess yourself up like that. But yeah, so that's what we've got going on right there with some over-ear options under 50 bucks. So that's going to bring us over um, real quick. This is what we're going to do real quick. So I appreciate you guys coming in, everybody hanging with me. Hey, I appreciate you guys, you know, saying that I, that's, you know, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to help out with, uh, <laughs> with the community. So Hef is the only one I know who does what he does. Hey, I'm not the only one. There are other people out there that do this kind of stuff. I, you know, giving back is, is really important. One of the biggest people that you see doing it on the platform is Mr. Beast with his philanthropy channel. Um, I can't do it at that level. Like I can't travel to Africa and like build wells and do all that stuff. But at, the, at least at a local level, I'm trying to do what I can to give back. And so I really appreciate you guys helping me out with that. Um, all right. So let's let's move into this really quick. All right. So as I said earlier at the beginning of this stream, uh, a portion of this stream is sponsored by Tribit and their Stormbox Flow speaker. So this guy right here, as you can see, so I've got it right here in my hands. So the, uh, this speaker right here, hold on, let me actually, let me, let me pull it up here really quick because that's one thing where I, I totally skipped my mind was like, hey, maybe I should, uh, <laughs> maybe I should open up a link with this speaker, but like a dummy, I totally forgot. Uh, let's see here. Whoop. Try bits. And where'd it go? There we go. There it is. All right. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Let's try that again. So yeah. So a portion of this video was sponsored by the Tribit Stormbox Flow. So check it out here. It comes in at 63 bucks. So it's 20% off right now, but they also have an additional coupon that you can clip right here to give you an additional 10 percent off so nice discount on this speaker right now coming from our friends over at tribit so this speaker it is packing 25 watts of power so this thing gets surprisingly loud for a speaker that is actually not all that big just you know kind of holding it here in my hands 
kind of surprising actually. Um, they also have their own X based technology. It's a tuning DSP and it boosts bass by nine decibels at the same power playback. Um, this guy's also IP67 water and dust proof rated. So no issues with this guy getting wet, nothing along those lines. This also has excellent battery life as well. Uh, up to 30 hours, just depends on how, you know, what kind of volume you're pushing these to, but you can get up to 30 hours on these guys. You can also pair two of these together. They do have TWS pairing. Um, they also have app support. So if you want to do uh, your own custom EQ or use one of, you know, many different presets that they offer, they do have that in there as well. Um, and obviously you can use this in different positions. You can have it laying down, you can have it sitting up, you know, it's got a lanyard right here. So if you want to hang it off of something, they've got you covered there as well. So right back here, we've got a USB charging port right here. So you can charge that via USB-C. So overall, very good. And then let me go ahead and fire it up real quick. Let's see if it, yeah, there we go, let's turn it on. All right, now let's bust out the trusty Pixel 8 Pro. And let's play, let's play a little bit of tunes here. So you, now, mind you, just to be clear, you're not gonna really be able to experience uh, what it truly sounds like, but I'm gonna play some music here and that way you can kind of get an idea of what it sounds like. So let's, let's do that really quick here. Not bad, eh? So let me try this other one too. Different vibe, different vibe. smooth baby but yeah so that's what it is right there that is the tribit stormbox flow as i said before you can pick this up on amazon right now 63.99 20 off and make sure that you clip that uh 10 coupon so you get an additional discount on this speaker but overall a very good choice if you want something you can throw in your bag that sounds good totally up to you but yeah definitely make sure you guys check that out if you're in the market for a Bluetooth speaker. So wanna give a huge thank you to my friends over at Tribit for sponsoring a portion of this video. Highly, highly appreciated. But yeah, let me get that out of the way. All right, let's see. <laughs> so Tribit has to be the most very pronounced company I've seen, Tribit, Tribit, Trib. Yeah, dude, I, I just call them Tribit, man. Like that's what I've been, <laughs> I don't know, man. Maybe it's cause I got tri-tip on the mind. I don't know, maybe that's what's going on there. <laughs> Yo, Sean Sanderson, good to see you, bro. Appreciate you, man. Let's see here. Uh, I was just going to ask if you were going to do speakers. Nice. <laughs> well, I had to throw that one in, man. I had to throw that one in, but I appreciate it, man. <laughs> uh, Grizzly001. Uh, so I actually, it's funny that you asked this question because I literally just dropped a video this morning on, on exactly the product that you are looking for. So it's this video right here. Let me go ahead and bring it up. So this video right here that says TWS for pros. So teleconference like a pro, the Poly Voyager Free 60 Plus UC. Definitely make sure you check out that video so you can hear the mic samples and see what those earbuds have to offer. But that's exactly what you're looking for. That is the right tool for that particular job. Um, but yeah, so make sure you check that out. Let's see. Uh, all right. Okay, so here we go. Okay. Yo, Bo Rerun's in the house. What's up, man? Appreciate you coming through. All right. So we've done, where are we at? So we've done 50. We've done 30. We did the headphones. Ah, so that brings us to the, it's a, to like my top choices under 100 bucks. So I'm going to start at my number one choice um, right now because it's discounted to this price. So it's not like it's normally a hundred dollars. <laughs> so, but it's discounted to this price. So we definitely got to bring it up, but just give me a sec while I uh, open up this link here and let's make it happen. Happen. All right, there we go. Boom. All right. So first things first. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What happened here? Did they, did they change it up on me? Oh no, they changed it up on me. Why would they do this to me? No, <laughs> don't tell me the sale is over. 
no oh no they must have sold they must have sold all of them out or something man i can't believe it i can't believe it all right well here's what i was going to show you but now it's like these are going to have to be under the under 200 category because for whatever reason now these are full price <laughs> they're not even remotely discounted now so these are 149 these were 99 dollars, no more than an hour ago and they were like that for hours for hours I think as much as yesterday still, like, I think they were going for 99 almost all week. And now they're 149. Like, bruh, why are they going to do me like that? <laughs> oh, come on, man. That's not right. That's not right. Wh whoever is messing around with prices for the OnePlus Buds Pro 2, whoever's on OnePlus's team, stop playing games. It's Black Friday. Why would you raise the price on Black Friday? Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Just man, come on, man. Like what? Come on now, dog. Come on, man. Bruh. Like what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a, that's quite embarrassing. But yes, I've got mine right here. These are the OnePlus Buds Pro 2 for people who are wondering. I've been talking about these earbuds for the longest time. For 99 bucks, these are an absolute freaking steal. Like what they deliver when it comes to sound quality to mic quality, transparency mode, active noise cancellation, multipoint, ease of use, comfort, everything that they deliver as a total package is seriously seriously good but for some reason amazon's got these at 149 dollars all of a sudden when they were 99 bucks for the better part of a week so yeah just throwing this out there just keep your eye on these i, I have a feeling that the price is going to drop back to 99 at some point so definitely keep an eye on them i don't know why they would raise the price on black friday like listen <laughs> so whoever is doing the amazon pricing for for one plus you need to slap yourself because like what what are you doing <laughs> what are you doing so yeah these earbuds are excellent man the the oneplus buds pro 2 i've been talking about them forever my favorite earbuds under 150 bucks um but yeah i still i can't believe they actually jacked the price up on them on black friday who raises prices on black friday like i'm just like why they gotta do me like that why they gotta do me like that bro like <laughs> Now, I understand, like, these are, they are 100% worth their full retail price, but why are they going to raise the price up on Black Friday? Like, you're killing me, bro. Killing me. You're killing me right now, man. So, now, let me, I'm going to move on because now I'm just, now I'm just irritated. Like, <laughs> they just, they just made me mad, bro. Like, how are you going to do me like that? That's just... <laughs> oh, man, I, I, I hate this for one plus. <laughs> How are they gonna do? How are they gonna mess up like that, bro? Like, oh god, dang! All right, you know what? Let's move on. Let's move on, man. So these recently topped my um my video for uh, the top true wireless earbuds under one hundred dollars. These took the number one spot firmly, one hundred percent believe that. And in the list that I just put out for under one hundred bucks, these are earbuds that are always under 100 bucks msrp under 100 on sale under 100 so they're always under 100 they're not earbuds that are normally 150 and then drop to 99 like that's not that's not how that works so it's these guys right here these are the earfun free pro 3 these were recently released an amazing set of earbuds um one of the latest qualcomm chips so you get snapdragon sound qualcomm aptex adaptive you get six microphones on board bluetooth 5.3 multi-point connectivity um, overall, super comfortable, excellent sound, available in three different colors. So you can get them in the, in the standard black, you can get them in the navy blue, you can get them in white as well. So you've got those options. Let me go ahead and bring them up. So I've got mine right here. And I did just, I did just drop a whole video on these for anybody who might be interested um, on, on seeing that. I actually do have an entire video on these guys right here. So you go to the live tab and you will see the Earfun Free Pro 2 right there. So if you wanna find out how I feel about them, definitely make sure you check out that video to give you the full rundown. But yeah, that's them right there, Earfun Free Pro 2s. You can see, like I said, these are small earbuds. I went ahead and put my uh, SpinFit Omni ear tips on these guys, shout out to SpinFit, always a great partner, and that's why I love using their products. But yeah, so definitely one to check out. These things definitely deliver serious sound, very comfortable, strong noise cancellation. And here's the better part of it. So they even listened to what some of the reviewers, like the feedback the reviewers were giving them. They recently dropped a firmware update for these guys that improved the noise cancellation with additional modes. They added an additional EQ option 
and they improved the transparency mode on these guys. So overall, if they weren't really good already, they made them that much better. And that's why they took the number one spot for me under 100 bucks. So definitely one to check out if um, you're interested in picking up a set of these right now for 63 bucks, 20% off. Definitely one to check out if you haven't done so already, man. But yeah, that's the Earfun Free Pro 3, a very, very solid choice right now for this price point. Uh, let's see here. Yo, Tech Preacher's in the building. What up, bro? How you doing, man? How you doing? How you doing? Let's see. They must be sold out on OnePlus website. Both colors are 99. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. I don't know why they did that. Yeah, the whites were the limited edition, 100%. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. What else we got? Sorry, just trying to catch up with the chat, make sure we're all good. How many buds in your collection total? The only answer to that question is yes. Um, let's see here. <laughs> There's still a 99 price, one plus buds pro two through the other sellers, even though the other seller is still Amazon. Bro, I, somebody over there is messing up, bro. <laughs> so put it like that. Somebody over there is really messing up. They're smoking that good stuff on Black Friday is what it is. They ate too much turkey. They went for a walk. <laughs> And they haven't come off that high yet. That's what's going on. So let me uh, bring up, the, <laughs> let me bring up the next one. <laughs> uh, let me see here. So another good deal um, are going to be from uh, from our friends over at JBL. So let me bring these up. And I love when these drop to this price because this makes them a steal, an absolute steal. So these guys right here, these are the JBL Live Free 2. You can also get the JBL Live Pro 2 as well. It's a, um, a STEM style version. But I prefer this version because they're more discreet. So this is why I prefer the JBL Live Free 2. I've been talking about them for a long, long time. Got mine right here. So if you, if you see my case, it's like the, these are warm, bro, because I use the heck out of these. <laughs> these are essentially like the size of like, um, I would say right around the size of like a Galaxy Buds Pro. So these are not huge earbuds um per se but yeah so that's them right there once again i've got my omni tips on them but yeah so that's the jbl life free two and these things are seriously good like they're they are packing a ton of features first of all jbl sound quality so high volume big bass excellent excellent sound full app support so you get adaptive eq you get adaptive anc i mean just seriously seriously good stuff you get excellent phone call quality super comfortable in addition to that, uh, I believe multi-point connectivity as well. Like these are truly, truly good earbuds. These are normally, these are MSRP $150 earbuds. So when they sell at 50% off for 75 bucks, we definitely got to talk about them. And I know a lot of people who've taken my advice and picked up the JBLs, whether it's the Live Pro 2 or the Live Free 2, have absolutely enjoyed them. These are a blast. So I really, really, truly like these. If you're waiting for a good discount to pick up a set of these, now is the time because they are on sale at 50% off so this is a very very solid set of earbuds you get them in black you can get them in silver i've got them in blue as you already saw and yeah overall truly truly a great set of earbuds excellent battery life on these as well so yeah yeah man i mean if you like jbl sound if you like nice thumping bass these are going to have you covered when it comes to that so yeah jbl live free two in the building definitely had to talk about those let's see here all right, so let's see here. Let's move on to the next one. And let me bring up that one real quick. Give me just a sec here. That one, okay. Excuse me. So these recently just popped up, um, which I'm kind of surprised that they're actually discounted right now. But they made their debut on my channel in my top five under 100 list. And that is the uh, the Samsung Galaxy Buds FE. So <laughs> unlike the disappointment that are the Samsung FE phones, <laughs> the FE uh, the FE Buds are actually surprisingly good. So yeah, shots fired. My bad. My bad. My bad. So, shout out to all my Samsung Galaxy FE phone owners. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just I'm just messing with y'all. I'm just messing with y'all. But yeah, so I've got them right here. These are the Samsung Galaxy Buds FE. Truly, truly impressed with these earbuds. Hey, Evan, take it easy, bro. Appreciate you coming through. So yeah, these are coming in right now for 69 bucks. Normally these are $99. Overall, very good. Full feature too. The only things, as far as I can tell that these are missing are like wireless charging. Like <laughs> aside from that, you get touch controls, you get excellent sound, you get strong noise cancellation, ambient mode, you get app support on Samsung devices and on Android devices. Sadly, no app support on iOS. That's a Samsung 
versus Apple thing, you know, whatever. I'm going to keep my name out of that. But overall, very, very good earbuds, compact. And these are essentially shaped like the old Galaxy Buds Plus. So they have the wing tips right here. So these things fit super secure. And I've got a set of SpinFit CP1025s on these guys. But overall, very, very good. Call quality is actually decent on these as well. Good volume, excellent sound quality. But yeah, very, very impressed with these guys. So I didn't think I was going to like them as much as I did. And then I'm like genuinely impressed. So yeah, that's why they made the top five under 100 list. I definitely had to talk about them here because there's no way, there's no way we could not talk about them in this live stream. They are super, super good earbuds. But yeah, so that's where we are with that. All right, so let's see here. Oh yeah, Don Coven has these. Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. <laughs> Yeah, no, I triggered the Samsung Knights. My bad, my bad. <laughs> I'm, I'm just playing, but not really. <laughs> Yo, Tim Windsor in the house. What's up, bro? Good to see you, man. I appreciate you coming through. Let's see. Edifier W240TN or Soundcore A3I. I would go with the Edifiers in that uh, in that comparison. So, uh, Carlos D. So, if you had watched this video right here, I rank them. They're both included in this video. The five best noise canceling earbuds under 100. The Galaxy Buds FE and the Earphone Free Pro 3 are in this video. So I recommend you check that out. And, you know, you'll see which ones are ranked higher. So definitely check that out, man. Definitely make sure you check out that video if you haven't. So that's, that's, what, the, that's what those videos are for, man. That's what those videos are for. <laughs> yeah, man. Says, uh, yeah, JBLs are great. The Buds 2 Pro were disappointing on sound quality. Yeah, the JBLs, dude, they really deliver, man. Like, that's the thing I want to make sure people are aware of. It's like, they're, they are not, they're, they are no joke. They are no joke, man. Uh, so let's see. Let's move into the next ones. Now, these are going to come uh, via my friends at Soundcore. And there's no way we can have a stream like this and not talk about Soundcore products. So obviously, we're going to bring these up. These are the Anchor Soundcore Liberty 4. So these were my top favorite earbuds for um, under 150 for a long time until they were dethroned by the OnePlus Buds Pro 2. And then once again, dethroned out of the number two spot by the Nothing Ear 2. So, but right now these are 78 bucks. If you're looking for a fully featured set of true wireless earbuds available in four different colors, this is gonna be really, really difficult to beat. I have a full review on my channel. I have these in multiple videos where I'm ranking different things. Um, these have some of the best call quality, some of the best sound quality that you can get. Um, in my opinion, still one of the best earbuds that Soundcore has ever made, but yeah. And um, I've actually got mine right here. So you've got them right there. As you can see, my Soundcore Liberty 4s right here. Plenty of use on these guys. So overall, very, very good. Now, a lot of people always ask me, you know, which one should I get? Should I get the Liberty 4, Liberty 4 NC? Normally, the Liberty 4 NC are under 100 and the Liberty 4s are over 100. So normally I tell people, it's like, if, well, you know, bang for buck, go with the NCs because you don't have to spend 100 bucks. But if you can afford to spend a little bit more, just go with the Liberty 4. That is the better of the two models. So just wanted to make that clear. But yeah, the Soundcore Liberty 4 is right here for 78 bucks. Definitely a good product in my opinion. Definitely a great price on these guys right now. So yeah, definitely something that was worth mentioning here in this stream. Um, let's see here. So that was Liberty 4s. Okay, where does that put us at? Ah, here we are. Okay, Lose, I'm losing track. All right, here we are. So let's jump out of here. Let me close this one up real quick. And let's go here. Now we can't we can't um, have this stream without these guys included here because still even after it's been I think it's been two years at this point, and these things are still stomping out earbuds, <laughs> which to me is crazy. Like it's it's absolutely wild that these are still as good as they are um, two years after they launched, and and other companies are still trying to catch up. And that is the Soundcore Liberty Three Pro. So mind you, here's the thing with the Liberty Three Pro. They're chunkers. They're chunky boys. So if you have small ears, these are probably not going to do well for you. But for pretty much everybody else who's tried them and who's gotten back to me have absolutely loved them. These are not for audiophiles. These are very, 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 very much a bass head centric <laughs> set of earbuds. So you got to like bass to, to enjoy these. Um, but yeah, so this is them right here. These are mine and the, I guess it's kind of purple. They called it dusk purple. So that's them right there. But yeah, 
definitely check that out. But considering the fact that right now they're coming in for 80 bucks, I mean, that's a steal in my personal opinion. These are excellent. So yeah, if you like a lot of bass, if you like a lot of treble, these definitely bring it to the table. Plus you get here ID, you get multi-point connectivity, you get wireless charging. I mean, you get full, full Soundcore app access. So overall a solid set of earbuds. And I know plenty of people that got these. There are a ton of people who I sent these to as gifts. So definitely one that we couldn't, you know, we couldn't just not talk about them in this stream. So definitely worth checking out if you haven't checked them out already, at least in my opinion, you definitely got to check those out. So um, let's see, what else do we have here? Okay, well, I don't know why I still have that one open. There we go. All right. <clears throat> All right, here we go. But yeah, there's a ton of stuff. Like if you look up, if you just look up Soundcore right now on Amazon, they got so much stuff on sale. It's wild. So let me, let me show you kind of how, how I would do it here. So it's like you go in here, you go to the Black Friday deal. So you click Black Friday deals. And then on the side right here, you scroll and you hit headphones. Boom. And that'll take you straight to like where most of the deals are. There's still some other ones that aren't listed here. Um, and I went ahead and just dug around for those. But yeah, you have a lot of the stuff just kind of sort of like put together for you already. So like Soundcore deals right here. You got the Space A40s for 54. You got the Live Q30 for 55. The Liberty 4NC right here for 69. So not bad. You got the Space Q45s there for 99. So overall, really, really good. But that's one way where you can kind of find all of their deals in one place. That's sort of the way to do it, in my opinion. If you, you know, if you didn't know, now you know. Now you know. <laughs> But yeah, so now let's move over real quick. Let's talk about some wireless headphones under 100 bucks. Let me, uh, I'm going to open up these links really quick so I can have them ready to go for like a rapid fire headphone round, like what we did just a few minutes ago. Uh, let's see here, pop these open and hopefully none of the prices have changed on me. Let's, let's not have that fiasco happen again. Uh, okay. And uno mas. Okay, there we go. All right, so, all right, so we're gonna start. So this is gonna be five options for wireless headphones under 100 bucks. Some deals are gonna be better than others, but I'm gonna give you five different options for anybody who's looking. Obviously, these are gift ideas. If you got kids who want headphones for Christmas, any of that sort of stuff, or if it's just something for yourself, this is gonna be the ones that are gonna be under 100 bucks. So let's bring them up. First things first, let's get started. Soundcore Space Q45. So these things are seriously good headphones. I have a complete and total comprehensive review on my channel on these headphones. So you can get them in three different colors. They've got them in black. They've got them in blue, my personal favorite. And they've also got them in white. So they got you covered there. Active noise cancellation, nice strong ANC. You get 50 hours worth of playback time. You get full Soundcore app support. And Soundcore has one of the best apps on the market for earbuds. Um, you do, or sorry, for earbuds and headphones and speakers. Um, you do get LDAC codec with these guys as well for high res listening. They are very comfortable. You do get some decent call quality out of these as well. Watch my review if you want to hear the microphone samples from these guys. But overall, very, very good. Bluetooth 5.3, you get excellent connection, excellent range. Overall, a great set of headphones. Very, very good in my personal opinion. So that's the first one. That is the Soundcore Space Q45. So your next one is going to be the Sony CH720N, normally 150 bucks, right now going for $98. Um, these will have stronger noise cancellation than the sound cores. The sound cores would have better sound quality than these guys and better features. So what Sony brings to the table with these guys is lighter weight, so lighter weight, and stronger noise cancellation. So that's the two things that these have an advantage over the sound cores. Sound core wins for literally everything else. But if you're a Sony person and you want a set of Sony headphones and you don't want to spend XM5 money, you can spend hundred bucks and these are a very, very solid option. Available in two colors as well. You can get them in white, you can get them in black. So two options there as well. These also have multi-point connectivity, Sony companion app support. They've got you covered when it comes to that stuff. Next up. The one more Sonoflow at $63. This is an absolute steal. They've got them in black. They've got them in blue. They've also got them in silver. Blue one looks super, super dope. These to me are one of the better sounding headphones out of all of the headphones that I'm talking about right now in this lineup. The tuning that one more put into the Sonoflow is 
excellent. They have strong noise cancellation as well. You get LDAC support, 70 hours worth of playback time. So these are overall a very, very solid set of headphones. So for 63 bucks, I mean, come on. The other two were 99 and 98. These are 63. That's a heck of a price drop. So overall, very good for my friends at One More. And if you're not familiar with One More, you need to get familiar because these are excellent, excellent cans. Next one, Edifier WH950NB. These are normally $200, <laughs> normally $200. So you got these down in 99 bucks. Again, full featured, you know, Bluetooth 5.3. You got LDAC, you get over 50 hours of playback time, Google Fast Pair, multi-point connectivity, app support with the Edifier Connect app. Uh, these are available in two separate colors. So these, the, the sound quality of these is more akin to like with one more, a much more balanced type of sound. Very, very good in my opinion. I was actually truly, truly impressed with these, uh, these headphones. So another option there from our friends at Edifier. Um, not a lot of coverage on these. You'll find some videos on these um, on, on YouTube, but not everywhere. You know, they're not everywhere. So, but definitely, definitely ones to check out. And then last but not least, last but not least, we've got the Beats Solo 3. These are on-ear headphones, not over-ear, on-ear. But you know how kids are, and I have to bring up Beats because you know how kids are nowadays is they only want Beats headphones. So if you don't want to spend a ton of money and you want to give somebody a set of Beats to, you know, like, hey, listen, you need to calm down. <laughs> Here's your Beats. Leave me the heck alone. This is your opportunity right now. Black Friday deal. You can get them in black. You can get them in red. You can get them in silver. You can get them in rose gold. So you've got the different options right there. These are the Beats Solo 3. Oh, my bad. I'm realizing I'm not even showing them to you guys. There we go. We got them in black. <laughs> you got them in red. You got them in silver. And you got them in rose gold. But definitely check them out. Hank, No, there are no Bose headphones under $100, sir. So the, well, I'm talking about headphones under $100. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Get it together, bro. Come on, man. So, yeah. So, these are 99 bucks right now. Mind you, the, now, these aren't like, if you're an audiophile, Beats aren't going to be for you. That's real talk. They're just not. Just not. But for, for you know, for your kids and your teenagers that don't really care about sound quality at that level, these are going to be fine. These are going to be perfect for them. So, considering 99 bucks, excellent, an excellent Christmas gift option for people who are looking for something like this. Their kids have iPhones and they want to get them a good set of headphones. Knock yourselves out, <laughs> knock yourselves out. I just, I'm bringing you, I'm bringing you the options that are available under 100 bucks. So yeah, let me take a quick sip and uh, we're going to move in to the earbuds under $200. This is where the competition gets thick, thick with three C's. So thick, like really thick, like Like thick like that, bro. All right. Okay, here we go. Woo. All right, man. We are moving. Let's go. All right. So let me go ahead and open this one up. And what I'm going to start with is just like I've started most of these is I'm going to start with what I feel is the, the best option under $200 in my opinion. Um, as far as performance, sound quality, you know, overall. Um, so that's the one where we are going to start. And considering the price that these are coming in at right now. <laughs> thick, exactly. Thick with an accent over the C. Exactly. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah. So, but considering the price point, considering all, all well, all things considered. Let's put it that all things considered. <laughs> Let's get that out of the way. It's going to be these guys right here. The status between three A and C coming in at 139. So this is the lowest price that I've seen these at. They started off at, I think it was either 229 or 250. Then they dropped to 199. Then a few weeks ago I saw them going in for like 150. Now they're at 139. I cannot recommend these earbuds enough. These are excellent. Excellent earbuds, triple drivers, noise cancellation, multi-point, excellent mics, long battery life, both button and touch controls. These things are excellent. The one thing that people complain to me about these is how they look because they look completely different than your standard earbuds. They don't look like your normal AirPod style earbuds. They look like status earbuds. They don't look the same as everything else. So some people love them, some people hate it. Personally, 
I'm not worried about what other people think. Like if I'm wearing earbuds and oh my God, those earbuds look weird. I don't care about other people's opinions. All I care about is the sound that's going into my ear holes. That's all I care about. So <laughs> that's that's the thing. The aesthetics of these, I'm not even tripping off that. You also get charged via USB-C. They also have wireless charging on board. I mean, all the bells and whistles are with these guys right here. So for me, this is, you're, you're hearing it from me very, very clear. I'm trying to state this as clearly as possible. This is the best option for true wireless earbuds under $200 right now. The very best option. The fact that they're coming in at 139, excellent. Absolutely excellent. So that's where we're at with these guys right now. 139, you can get them in black. You can get them in, uh, I believe this is their bone is what they call this. Yeah, bone, which is like off white, but yeah. Oh, whoops, wrong camera. Bam, there we go. <laughs> But yeah, and I went ahead and dropped my spin fit tips on these as per usual. But yeah, these are truly, truly excellent. This is this is one of the earbuds that always stays in my earbud rotation weekly. So there's like my my Denons, which we'll talk about in a, in a little bit. But yeah, these these are one of the ones that always stays in rotation because they are absolute fire. So definitely one to check out if you want the best under two hundred dollars right now. That is in my in my humble opinion, in, in your Boyle Hefe's humble opinion. Um, the status between 3A and C are the best true wireless earbuds you can get under $200 in 2023 right now. It's just making that as clear as I can for you. All right. So now moving on to the very next one, um, which for me um, would be, I guess, you know, runner up to these because um, they're also one of the best options that you can get under 200 bucks. Sadly, there aren't really much, uh, there, there's no discount on these, but I want to talk about them anyway, because I would be doing you guys a disservice. Um, if I didn't mention these, especially when it comes to comfort, to very, very clean balanced tuning, and for mic call quality, very, very good. So let me bring these up here real quick. That is the Nothing Ear 2. Coming in at 139, like I said, there isn't any discounts on these. I don't know why there aren't any discounts on these. I wish they would have discounted them. That would have been kind of cool, but sadly, there isn't. So, but yeah, that's the Nothing Ear 2s right here. Um, I've actually got mine right here so that's them right there the the cool thing about nothing in the ear twos is it's a cool comeback story man because the nothing ear ones were for lack of a better word trash and they they listened to everybody's feedback they took that into account and then came back with a much much better product strong anc much better mics much better trans uh, transparency mode and they truly improved that sound quality so they really really brought it with the nothing ear too looks like there's a ten dollar coupon on these right now so if you want to well a little bit of a discount right the coupon apply ten dollars that's that's better than nothing so you can get a little bit of a discount but i'd be doing you a disservice if i didn't talk about these in this stream so that's why i wanted to make sure that i brought those up um but yeah so that's where we are with those right there um yeah, let me move over here real quick. Also want to give a quick shout out to my guy, Buzz703. I appreciate you, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for the donation. Once again, all these Super Chat donations, I'm going to be saving these up. And then in a couple of months, we'll make another big donation over to the Alameda uh, County Food Bank. But thank you so much, man. I appreciate you, bro. Yo, Peter just bought the earbuds. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. I appreciate it. I'm, I'm glad that I could help you with that purchase decision. So yeah, glad I could help there. Um, let's see here. Where are we at? How did I get all these earbuds mixed up? What happened here? Where, where did all these, <laughs> what happened here? All right, here we go. Uh, okay. So let me close that out real quick. All right. Now, speaking of another good option for, for calls, this is going to be a, a, a shout out, a major shout out. <laughs> well, this is going to be a major shout out to the, um, to Team Pixel right here with the uh, Google Pixel Buds Pro. Now, one thing that I will say, and I thought is, is this is a little shady, this is a little bit of shady here going on, um, is the fact that all the colors are 119, except for the Bay Blue. The Bay Blue is still 199. Come on, son. Come on, why are they gonna do us like that? Why is the Bay Blue still 199? Like, are you serious right now? But every other color of all the other of all the other five colors are 119 right now. So you can get them fog, you can get them in charcoal, you can get them in coral, lemongrass, porcelain, everything but Bay Blue. <laughs> Which is messed up. Like, what are y'all doing? 
What, why, why are they going to do us like that, bro? So yeah, that's what's going on. But yeah, so that's the Pixel Buds Pro right here from Google. An excellent set of earbuds in their own right. Solid sound quality out of these. And some of the best noise-canceling microphones for phone calls that I've ever heard. Overall, an excellent, excellent choice. Especially if you're somebody who is on Team Pixel and you are in the Google Pixel ecosystem. Let's say you have a Pixel device, maybe a Pixel tablet. You know, if you're, if you're running this Google Pixel lifestyle, then this is a very, very solid choice. But if you want something that's comfortable, something that blocks out a ton of noise, something with good mics, something with good sound, the Google Pixel Buds Pro are an excellent option. And seeing them come in at 119 for five out of the six colors is surprisingly good, surprisingly good. So yeah, I wanted to make sure I brought that up because um, yeah, man, shout out to, to Team Pixel. We don't get big discounts on the Pixel Buds Pro too often. So it's really nice to see that when they do come around. Um, and that's why, you know, we want to give credit where credit is due. So we want to see more discounts. We want to make sure I shout them out and, uh, let them know like, Hey, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate the discount, man. I appreciate the discount. So next up, let's move over to the next one. So the next one's going to be these guys right here, the Samsung galaxy buds Two pro coming in at 30% off. So $159, uh, all, all the three colors, you can get them in Bora purple. You can get them in white. You can get them in, I believe it's uh, graphite as well. So you have that option. But Bora Purple is the one that I'm rolling with right here. So I've got mine right there. So as you can see, Bora Purple. I got my spin fit tips on them already. But yeah, that's the Bora Purple for the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro. Overall, a very, very solid set of earbuds. Good mics on these. Strong noise cancellation. Good sound quality as well. If you're looking for something sound quality wise, it's more on the balanced side, right? So more balanced sound. Um, these are going to be a very, very good option for you. So overall, very, very good in my opinion for anybody who's looking for a set of the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro 159 for Black Friday. Overall, I think it's a good deal considering normally they're, you know, 200 bucks plus. So yeah, just throwing that out there. So let's see. We still got a lot of earbuds to go through, man. So we're getting there though. Little by little, we're getting there. <laughs> Oh man. So let me see here. Where are we at? All right. So next one is going to be, ah, right. Oh, we'll get this out of the way. Okay. So next one's going to be, and this is probably the biggest discount that I've seen on these. I think ever, I think this is the biggest discount I've ever seen on these. And that's on the Sennheiser momentum true wireless three at $168. Now these have been topping people's lists for, um, you know, best sounding earbuds for a while now, you know, for a while. And they only got better with some of the, some of the recent, well, I guess not recent, it's been a few months since they released like the high res updates um, via, via firmware updates on these guys that only further improved the sound quality. So these things are seriously serious earbuds. Um, got mine right here. So as you can see, that is the Sennheiser Momentum True Wireless 3. So yeah, man, these things come in multiple colors as well. They've got them in an all black. And they've also got them in a graphite, and then you can also get them in white. So you got three different color options. But 168, this is the lowest that I've ever seen the Momentum True Wireless 3 by far. Like I've never seen them come in at this low price. So you get strong noise cancellation, you get multi point, you get excellent sound, you get strong bass response out of these guys as well. So overall, a solid set of earbuds for anybody who's looking for a set of Sennheisers for Black Friday, that is another option for you. Um, now let's see here who is up next after those guys. Uh, another discounted one that came up, which I was kind of surprised, not a huge discount. I think they've been sort of sitting at this price for a bit, but um, they do have them discounted. It's like 30% off. So I'll go ahead and bring them up. Where'd they, where'd they go? Well, I'm actually not sure if, well, here, I'll, I'll just bring them up here because I don't know if the ones that I have here are the ultras or the, or the regulars. So, <laughs> <laughs> but it's the uh, the Bose Quiet Comfort 2 coming in at 199. So basically if you need just like the strongest active noise cancellation that money can buy under $200, this is it. Like these are if you really need to block out all the sound around you, <laughs> like this is going to be it right here. These do an excellent job of blocking out noise whether you're on an airplane, on a bus, in your office, whatever. These are top tier 
noise cancellation. So they are not perfect. They don't have all the features, bells and whistles that a lot of other earbuds have, but their main claim to fame is that active noise cancellation strength, which they definitely deliver in spades. Um, it, it could even be too strong for some people. You know, I don't, I don't know your personal preferences, but it could even be str- too strong for some people. So I just want to throw that out there, but not bad for the price considering um, what they, what they bring to the table. Now let's see here. Let me move into these guys really quick. So now let's talk about, I'm going to bring up some headphones under $200. Um, so let me open up these links one more time. We'll do it again. Another rapid fire with the headphones here. Uh, boom. And I got four options for you under 200 bucks. So we'll be talking about those really quick. Just give me a sec while I load them up. All right. So let's bring these up here. Give me just a sec. All right. So, all right. Let's see here. All right. All right, first up. So these are wireless headphones options under 200 bucks. So bring them up. Boom. First up, we got the Bose Quiet Comfort 45, or also known as the QC45. So once again, top tier noise cancellation. I actually tested these, uh, I think it was two years ago on a flight back from LA, and they are <laughs> superb at blocking out uh, engine noise from a from a jetliner. Like I was truly, truly impressed with that. I got, I, I don't understand. Like here, here's one thing I got to say this real quick. I don't understand how people will take flights and have like no earbuds or, or headphones on. Like <laughs> I can't do it. I can't like, some. there's just people just sitting there just in the open, just whatever. Like I can't, bro, I cannot do it. Like <laughs> I can't, I got to have some sort of noise canceling headphones on. Like I cannot do that jet noise for hours. Like it, mm-mm, no, mm-mm, can't do it. So, so yeah, but yeah, the Bose Quiet Comfort 45, these things are excellent. Sound quality on these is surprisingly good. Not the best out there, but what they're really known for is their noise cancellation ability. Like that's really what, what it comes down to. They do have multi-point. Sound quality is decent enough for a headphone at this price, but overall very, very good. And it's nice to see them discounted from 329 down to 199 So I love to see that. So next up, you've got the Beats Studio Pro normally 350 down to 169 so these are available in multiple colors i've got them in navy myself uh they've got them in black they've got them in brown and they've also got them in sandstone you got all four of those options so beat studio pro like i said another option if there's people in your life who swear they need to have beats headphones because that i i know people like this I know people like this, that if you're going to get them any sort of audio product, it's got to be AirPods or it's got to be Beats. That's that's all they know and that's all they want. So if that's somebody like that in your life, this is another good option right here. If you want to spend a little bit more than 100 bucks, this is your option right there from Beats. You got the Beats Studio Pro. These are overall a solid set of headphones, but that's another option for you. Third, You've got the Skull Candy Crusher ANC2. This is the new version of the Skull Candy Crusher coming in at $184. This is for the true, the true base aficionados. Like <laughs> if you if you just want bass that's just gonna rattle your head, like you don't care about sound quality, you don't care about any of the other stuff. You just want bass that's gonna tickle your eardrums. This is gonna be what it is so 184 bucks for these guys a good discount normally 229 um but these are overall some serious headphones i still actually have my crusher evos um i I only use them whenever i want to tickle my brain that's the only time that i'll actually try those out but yeah so definitely had to bring these up you know for people out there who who are true bass heads there's nothing better than the skull candy crusher um evo anc2 these guys are the ones you want to roll with um, if you're going to spend 138 on like the, the Hesh ANC, skip those, just get the Crusher ANC twos. Just go with those. Last but not least, you got the all new Sennheiser Accentum Bluetooth headphones, 50 hour battery life, hybrid noise cancellation. These were released maybe two months ago at the, at the outside, maybe two months ago. So coming in at 149 bucks, excellent sound overall, very, very good headphones, not the greatest out there, but considering 150 bucks, you can get a set of Sennheisers for under 200, a very solid option for you. So 150 bucks, very good for me. I, I like the sound quality of these. Actually, out of the four options here, out of the Sennheisers, the Skullcandies, the Beats, and the Bose, I prefer the Sennheiser Accentum 
for their sound quality. So overall, a very, very good set of headphones, in my personal opinion. Um, you still get multi-point connectivity. You still get long battery life. You got some decent mics on these as well. So overall, a very good choice. So those are the four wireless headphone options coming in for under 200 bucks, four options, under 200. Links for everything that I'm talking about are in the video description down below. Yeah, so that's where we are. <laughs> So now, now, okay. So we're we're home stretch, baby. Home stretch. So now it's the all the all the other earbuds that are over two hundred dollars. So these are basically um, at the top. Like what are the top earbuds right now uh, at the at the higher price points? Basically. So let me close these out real quick, and we'll start talking about those. Um, give me just a sec. Bear bear with your boy El Jefe. Real quick. Hey, good to see LaShawn, man. I didn't think you were going to come in. Appreciate you, bro. Slept through the first 25 minutes, bro. Come on, sir. How you going to do me like that, man? Man, that's messed up, bro. I see you, LaShawn. I see you, bro. It's all good. All right. Let me bring these up real quick. Give me just a sec. Okay. So we got that. All right. That one there. Okay. And who else do we got? Okay. All right, so let's start with these. Any other ones? Uh, we'll bring those up too. Why not? Why not? Why not? All right. What the heck? Uh oh. Whoops. Attach to another window. There we go. Okay. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> all right my bad didn't mean to hold up the stream like that but let's jump in man so let's jump in let me grab these really quick we'll pull these out pause all right so first things first obey your thirst not exactly a black friday deal but i i do want to talk about these just because they are still my numero uno so I'm going to bring these up here real quick. These are the Denon Pearl Pro. So because people will ask me like at any price, like price doesn't matter. What is your favorite earbuds? What are the top ones in your opinion? It's the Denon Pearl Pro. These are 350 bucks. These are the formerly known as the Nura True Pro. So uh, Nura the, as a company was acquired by Denon. So they were rebranded as the Denon Pearl Pro. So I do have both the Nura and the Denons. I didn't hear much of a sound difference between the two. So, but yeah, but that's where we are with these guys. So I've got mine right here. These are the Denon Pearl Pro. Excellent. I mean, they bring everything to the table. The biggest thing being um, Nura's or now Denon's sound personalization. It is next level. It is so, so good at creating a custom EQ and it does it automatically for you based on your ears. And it is so, so, so freaking good. And in the app, they also have a bass slider. So you can adjust how much bass you want. Super, super simply. Um, they call it like immers immersion mode or something like that. Very good. In addition to that, you also get ANC, you get transparency mode. They have spatial audio on board as well. It's subtle, but it's very, very effective depending on the kind of music you listen to. Overall, very, very good. Multipoint compatible as well. They have a high gain mode if you need more volume. So overall, one of the better earbuds on the market, in my opinion, the best when it comes to sound. Like when I was talking about how the status between Pro stay in my rotation, these are always in my rotation. So I figured I would bring them up and let you guys know which ones are my numero uno at this time but yeah so that's the denon pearl pro obviously not for the faint of heart when it comes to the wallet but next one we've got the techniques az80 these are these do have a black friday deal at 222 dollars they are available in two different colors so you can get them in silver you can get them in black um, i've got mine right here in black so these are the techniques az80 one of the very very best i mean these are just to me I rank these just under the Denon Pro Pro as far as true wireless earbuds go in 2023. Just excellent sound, excellent noise cancellation. These can multi-point up to three devices where most others on the market only do two. These can do three. They also support LDAC in multi-point mode, which to me is just crazy. So overall, very good. Excellent call quality as well. Super, super comfortable earbuds. Excellent battery life on these guys. Overall, one of the very, very best like peak predators that are highly underrated in my opinion because people tend to talk about bose tend to talk about sony or apple 
dude, techniques, people are sleeping on how amazing these earbuds are. So overall, one of the very, very best ones on the market. I'm happy to see that they came in with a Black Friday discount. So I love, love to see that. So definitely if people were thinking about picking up the AZ80, you know, do yourself a favor. If you're in the market for them and you can afford that price, it's a solid buy, a 100% recommendation from your boy El Jefe. The Techniques AZ80 are definitely, definitely highly recommended from me. So yeah, um, but that's that one. That was Denon. Those are Techniques. Um, another one that comes up, and this is kind of surprising because they <laughs> there's a discount. <laughs> but wait, wait till you see this discount. <laughs> It's is nine percent off, bro. <laughs> they couldn't even give us a whole ten percent. Come on, son, a whole ten percent at least. But I figured I would bring them up. These are the uh, Bang and Olufsen BioPlay EX. Um, some of the better sounding earbuds on the market, as far as true wireless earbuds go. Uh, I've got mine right here. So here are my BioPlay EX. Let's see if it'll focus. There we go. Those, those are my BioPlay EX right there. I've had these for a long, long while. I've got a full video of these on the channel as well for anybody who's interested. But yeah, that discount, as soon as I saw it, I was cracking up. I'm like, 9% fam, really? <laughs> you couldn't give us 10%. You couldn't give us 25%, no, 9%. Like, <laughs> who's sitting there writing these prices like, you know what? We're going to hit them at 9%. <laughs> Oh, they'd be killing me with that, bro. Like, so, but Bang & Olufsen EX, excellent sound on these earbuds. So I really like them. Um, but yeah, definitely, definitely. It's whenever we can get a discount on a set of $400 earbuds, I'll take it. If it's 9%, whatever. So exact. Thank you, Barry. Like, they could have given us 8% off, but they didn't. They gave us the full, the full 9%. So yeah. All right. So let me, uh, let me jump out of here. What is that? Oh, now it's not. Now it doesn't want to bring up my comments. That's messed up, man. That is messed up. All right. I guess that's what's going on here. Uh, all right. So my chat thing broke. Yeah. All right. It is what it is. All right. So then the last one, last but not least, is going to be the Sony WF-1000 XM5 coming in at 17% off at $248. So I was actually surprised that we even got any kind of discount on these because they're still on the new-ish side and sony tends to not give big discounts um within like three to six months of an earbud releasing um so 17 percent off still not bad overall a very very good set of earbuds definitely an improvement over the sony wf 1000 xm4s in my opinion so these are much more comfortable the sound quality is improved the active noise cancellation is improved the call quality is improved and i know people have been have been on me to release a video on these earbuds and i've just been lacking i've been slacking on my mackin when it comes to these earbuds, but definitely um, something that's very, very good in my opinion. Not the best, like there are a lot of people who will uh, be out here saying, yeah, the Sony XM5 is the best true wireless earbuds on the market in 2023, 100% cap. Just um, my guess is because they just haven't tried enough earbuds. So, cause you'll get people saying that kind of stuff and they have, they, they, they've only tried like AirPods and like Galaxy Buds and like stuff like that. I'm like, you haven't tried everything. If you haven't tried Techniques, if you haven't tried Denon, if you haven't tried Status Audio, if you haven't tried, you know, BO Play EXs or the Bowers and Wilkins or, you know, it's like you, you got to really expand out there before you say that kind of stuff. But um, I've got, got them right here. These are the, wait, actually, hold on. I grabbed the wrong case. These are the XM4s. Come on, sir. Bam. This thing, no, nope, that's the Link Buds S. Come on, where'd they go? I had them, I had them just a second ago. Where'd they go? Uh, oh, duh. Right here. All right, there we are. <laughs> had to bust out the X and Fives. If it'll focus, if it'll focus, there we go. All right. Sony WF-1000 XM5 right here. Coming in at 248 for Black Friday. That is the deal that they've got going on on these today. So definitely ones to check out if you're in the market for them. They're very good. Are they the best? No. But as a overall jack of all trades, a very good set of earbuds in my personal opinion. So, but yeah. But if I was going to pick something over $200 right now, right now, if I was going to do that, um, I would definitely be rocking with the, um, I'd be rocking with the Techniques AZ80. So that's where my money would go. They're 222 right now on Amazon. There's a link in the video description. If you want to spend over $200 on a set of earbuds in 2023, I would recommend highly, highly recommend the Techniques AZ80. So AZ80. So yeah. But that's where we are, man. That is the list right there of 
the Black Friday deals. Now, obviously, there's a ton of different deals, but um, if you're interested in checking out any of the deals that I mentioned today, as I as I mentioned before, all of the links to all of this stuff are going to be in the video description box. Look, we got Streamception. So <laughs> look, it's you guys right there. There's the chat. So Streamception, but all the links are right here in the video description. You can check out the Tribit Stormbox Flow. Shout out to Tribit for sponsoring a portion of this stream. Um, but you got the earbuds under 30. So I've got everything categorized for you. Earbuds under 30 for bass, earbuds under 30 for balance sound, earbuds under 50, wireless headphones under 50, earbuds under 100, uh, wireless headphones under 100, earbuds under 200, and uh, your all others, or actually wireless headphones under 200 right here. I got to put a space there. And then all others above 200, including our spin fit tips as well. So this is one that I meant to, to check out. I just, it just kind of skipped my mind real quick. So that's a, my bad, but the spin fits also got discounts going on right now. Um, whether they're either doing 10% coupons or 15% coupons on all of their ear tips. So if you're looking at upgrading your ear tips with a set of Omnis for your true wireless earbuds or your CP 1025s for the low profile stuff, the W ones for your IEMs, They've got either 10% off or 15% off on these guys right now. So they are an excellent upgrade for people who need it. Do you have to buy SpinFit tips to enjoy your earbuds? Absolutely not, but you guys know how I roll. I've been using SpinFit tips since long before I was ever partnered with them. They're not even sponsoring the stream. I'm just giving them a shout out because of how many times we showed them during this video. Um, they make excellent, excellent products. You guys should definitely check them out. Support the people that support me in being able to bring these videos and streams to you. So huge shout out to them as well. Um, but yeah, man, that's that's it for that stuff, man. But now we're just chilling, man. So yeah, <laughs> this is, we've been, bro, we've been streaming for a minute. I, I'm like, man, how long have I been live? It's two o'clock. It's two o'clock my time. So you know, it's I've been out here for a minute. Let's see, we're an hour and 35 minutes in. Good God almighty. All right, let's see. Let me go back here real quick. All right. Okay, and then let's jump in. Let me jump into the to the Chizat. All right, what is happening here? Hey, I saw I saw my guy Digital Slank came through. What up, man? Tanny's in the building. Yeah, see, hold on. I'm gonna close out this chat. I'm gonna see if I could bring it back in because I don't know what happened and why my chat got messed up, man. That's not that's not cool. Uh, hold on, restore chat. Okay, one more time. Pop out chat. So I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to bring my chat in again so that I could pop up your comments again. Get overlay, copy. Okay, let's try this one more time. Okay. Okay, let's see if it works this time. No. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I guess my chat thing is broken. Oh well. <laughs> well, that sucks. I'll still I'll, I'll still keep like reading off your guys' comments though for sure. So no no worries there. Uh, let's see here. So I saw Marcus came in. What up, bro? Good to see you, man. My guy, Digital Slang, appreciate that. Come on, Heavy, stop showing us the wrong case. Come on, bro, give me a break, man. <laughs> now we got LaShawn in here uh, hassling me. Bruh. Come on, man, don't do me like that. Too many earbuds, no such thing. But yes, you're right. Uh, let's see. <laughs> let's see here. <laughs> I got the got the OnePlus Pro 2 and the Soundcore Liberty 4. So far, I really like the OnePlus. Oh, absolutely, me too. Me too. <laughs> Oh man, let's see here. Got the Sony uh, WFXM5 for 230. Nice, not bad, eh? For 150 US USD, that's pretty good, man. That's pretty good. So yeah, hey, no worries, Aditya. That happens, bro. I, I know how it goes. Yep, spin fits are definitely the truth, man. Let's see. Would you say Eugene's asking? Would you say that the techniques sound better than the Momentum's? I would say the techniques AZ80 sound better than the Sennheiser Momentum. Yes, I would definitely say that. Um, Sam Foster, El Hefe, are you on Facebook? Yes, I just don't respond to people's messages. So just make that clear. Here, here's the thing you have to understand. People will try to message me as if I don't have so much going on. And you have to understand that if you think you're the only person messaging me, you are absolutely not the only person. There are so many people sending me messages on Instagram, on Facebook. Like I simply don't have time. People will even try to email me. Don't do that. It's not that I don't want to help you. If you want to get help from me, you have to leave a comment on one of my videos. That's the only place that I'm dedicating actual time to responding to people. But if you reach out to me via any other platform, nine times out of 10, I'm not going to respond. And I'm just being very clear. I'm not saying that to be messed up, to be rude or to be a dick. I just, it, I'm a one person team. I don't have a social media manager. I don't have somebody else taking care of that stuff. So it's only me. And I, I, I can't spend that kind of time doing that kind of thing. 
So, you know, when people try to reach out to me on Facebook, I don't, I don't respond. I, I plain and simply, the only reason I'm even still on Facebook is just for family. But aside from that, I don't even really, yeah, that's not even my platform of preference. Um, just making that clear. Let's see here. Uh, just bought the four NC right before this video. And uh, now I feel like I should have ordered the fours. Either way, you got a good deal, bro. So, yeah. <clears throat> uh, TB, do I advise status between A and C over the OnePlus? Yes. Yeah. I, I literally said that a little while ago. Let's see here. And uh, I already answered a question. So here's the thing, and I'm going to make this really clear. Um, don't don't comment. Uh, don't, don't spam the chat because Barry's here too. So if I don't answer your question immediately and you think I'm just going to copy and paste this over and over again, Barry's just going to boot you out of the chat. So I'm just warning you guys right now because he will do it. So <laughs> yo, Rich Music Tech Reviews, good to see you, bro. Sorry, my chat's broken, so I can't bring up comments anymore for some reason. I don't know what's going on. Um, let's see here. Which spin fits for the XM5? Uh, you want to get the spin fit Omni for the uh, Sony XM5s. Yeah um let's see here i'm gonna buy the q45 mr orlando bob hey that's what's up man uh what's the name of the spin fit adapters for soundcore liberty 4 nc uh, cpa2 but if you if you look up the spin fit um tips for the galaxy buds pro you'll see that they actually come with with the adapters and the ear tips in a in a kit and that's the one you want to buy Let's see here. Yo, Sean Sanderson, what's up, man? Uh, a streamer Moondrop was mentioned by El Jefe. <laughs> I had to do it. I had to do it. Let's see here. Snatch the XM5 for two seventy nine on eBay. Brand new. Nice. Um, let's see. Uh, Arnish is asking, what, uh, was one of your thoughts on LinkBuds S versus JBL iPro 2? Oh, bro, get the JBLs. <laughs> get the JBLs. That's sound for sound quality, for sound quality, and feature for feature. Go with JBL, man. 100%. Yeah, you'll, you'll be happy with those, man. Yeah, that's that's gonna be the move for sure. But yeah, there's a lot of good deals for Black Friday though right now, man. There's a lot of good stuff. So Sam says, hey, thanks for helping me out with the spin fit. Oh yeah, yeah, no worries, man. No worries. Definitely, definitely worth checking out. There's actually, if you go to my review of the Liberty 4 NC, I put a link to the exact spin fit kit in the video description there. So I think I might even put it as a pinned comment. I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Excuse me. But yeah, man. Yo, Jason, good to see you, bro. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm already an hour and 40 minutes in, so my voice is almost a wrap. So I got maybe 20 more minutes in me, and that's it. Because <laughs> we still got LaShawn's stream. My guy, holler at your boy. He still has his stream later on tonight, man. So it's, man, it's, yeah. <laughs> We're getting there, bro. I need sleep. Y'all don't even know what I've been through the past week. <laughs> to, not only to, like, uh, to, to do the stream on Monday, and then produce a video to get a video out by this morning the video that nobody watched and then <laughs> and then to do this stream as well bruh i am whooped dude i am so whooped man um but yeah the let me see where's it at where's the video that nobody watched hang on <laughs> let me bring that up uh, here it is. So, so for people that missed it, I, I did drop a video. I dropped a legit an actual, like a whole video right here. <laughs> TWS for pros. These are for teleconferencing. So th these are like the most exciting earbuds on the market. These are literally for, for business people, um, for teleconferencing, for anybody who's using Microsoft teams or zoom, um, stuff like that for work. That's what these earbuds are designed for. Um, the connectivity on these earbuds, um, the, they're the poly voyager free use, uh, 60 plus UC is wild. It's wild. Um, so I can hold on. I've got them right here. So check this out. Let me take a quick sip here. So peep game. So I've got them right here. Check this out. Let's see if I can get them to come up here. Boom. All right. So the earbuds, so they have a touchscreen case, mind you, right? So let me go ahead and take them out. So here's the earbuds right here. So let me pull the earbuds out real quick. All right. So now that they're out, so let me X that out real quick. So you've got the menus here. So you got battery life. This is noise cancellation and transparency mode. These are your media controls right here. So you can like play, pause, volume, all that stuff. You swipe over, you get Bluetooth pairing controls. They can connect, they can multi-point to two devices, but they can remember up to eight devices. So you can pick like what device you want to connect them to, you can switch right there from the screen. 
Um, and then they also have a volume control right here as well, plus a QR if you want to download their app. But these things are legit. And in addition to this, right, connectivity, right? So already they can multipoint. So they can multipoint to two devices. Remember eight. You also have a Bluetooth adapter right here. So this is a USB-C Bluetooth adapter. So you can plug this into your phone. You can plug this into your PC. So that way you can use the earbuds super easy. They pair to it. It's, it's so simple. Stores them right here. And last but not least, as far as connectivity goes, so USB-C, right? They come with a USB-C to 3.5 millimeter cable. So if you want to connect it to like an in-flight entertainment system or some other device that doesn't have Bluetooth, you can pair, you can basically connect it to that and the case will stream the audio to the earbuds wirelessly. Like connectivity wise, these things are the absolute truth. And that's why um, I was very, very impressed with them. So I dropped the video on them this morning. Great for people who need a set of like work from home, hybrid work. Uh, earbuds but yeah but because they're not super exciting there isn't a lot of hype around these earbuds uh you know that video is not doing what it should views wise but um so long as the right people who need that type of a product um see it and that's all that really really matters and that's what's most important but yeah just wanted to bring that out there let's see aditya let's see here uh, I was thinking, grab Bose QC45, or should I go XM4? I prefer comfort and bass heavy sound with ANC. Ooh, Aditya, go with the XM4s. Yeah, you'll be you'll be very happy with those. Uh, Sean Sanderson, only spam allowed is fried. Thank you, sir. Exactly. <laughs> Are there any key advantages or disadvantages for JBL Free 2 versus JBL Pro 2? Uh, no, the only advantage that the Pro 2 has over the Free 2 is additional battery life but it's it's not even by much. We're talking like 30 minutes. So yeah, this is why I always recommend people go with the JBL free to over the JBL pro two. So yeah, um, let's see here. What else we got? That case is doing the most. It really is, bro. <laughs> oh man, yeah, it, it really is. <laughs> yeah, so no, the, so and mind you, just to be clear too, like, um, you know, headphones, when it comes to like, uh, a, a set of headphones like that for teleconferencing for work and stuff like that. That's a business expense. Like that's where your job would have to buy that for you. They would have to cover that expense because th that's a tool for work. Just like if your company buys you a laptop or whatever, like for you to use, that's a tool. Like if they buy you a desk, if they buy you a chair, like any of that sort of stuff, any of the, of the equipment that helps you do your job, that's a business expense. So whether your your company pays you back or you get it on your taxes, one or the other, but that's that's a business expense, 100%. Uh, JBL Free 2 doesn't seem to be available in my country, but the Pro 2 is. Thinking of maybe just picking them up. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Would they be a better choice than the Liberty 4NC? For, in my opinion, the JBL Live Pro 2, Live Free 2 are a better option than the Liberty 4NC, 100%. Yeah, 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 for sure. Yo, my guy T in the building. What up, bro? I can't bring up comments, man. My comment, my comment thing died for some reason in the middle of my stream. It was working just fine, and then it just poof be gone, man. But let's hit it one time for my guy T, man. It's the money. It's, it's the money. It's, it's the money. Yeah. It's the money. It's, it's the money. It's, it's the money. Yo, thank you, man. I appreciate that, bro. And you know how we do, man, with the with the super chats and the donations. Uh, you know, I save them up and we ship them over to the Alameda County Community Food Bank. Uh, for anybody that missed it, I talked about it earlier today, but I also posted it in my community tab um, where I recently sent over all of the super chats. So basically, I saved up all the super chats from July 16th all the way to November uh, 22nd. 441.48 was the total of those super chats. And I went ahead and just rounded that up to 500 and matched it. So basically I sent over a thousand dollars. The $30 covers uh, Alameda County food banks fees to, to uh, accept that payment. And they have a group of angel investors that are matching donations. So our $1,000 donation uh, as an El Jefe Reviews community is now a $2,000 donation. And also want to give a shout out to my guy, Danny Wingett. If you guys aren't familiar, Danny Wingett, Danny Winget. Uh, he also has a tech YouTube channel. He matched my, he, he matched our donation. He added a, an additional $500 donation. He sent that over to the food bank as well. He didn't have to do that, but he matched us. So shout out to Danny. He's a real one. And that's not the first time he's done that. That's actually the second time that he's done that. So that dude is super, super cool. Love that guy. 
So just throwing that out there. But yeah, let's see. Yeah, exactly. If you And for anybody who needs a phone case, make sure you guys go check out my guy, Technically T's channel. That is the phone case too. He, Technically T is to phone cases what I am to earbuds. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So that's that's my guy though, man. That's my guy. So hopefully, hopefully at some point we get a chance to link up again, man. I was like, you know, it's 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 it feels like it's been too long because it's been since what Bit Summit like f almost two years ago, man. That's wild, bro. Time just flies, man. Spin Fit Omni's just arrived. Nice, heck yeah, dude. Yeah, those are the ones to roll with, man. If you if you want to get them, uh, you know, uh, for your ear, but it just depends on the application because they don't fit everything. Um, some cases are just too small, like um, the Soundcore Space A40 are too small, uh, Galaxy Buds Pro are too small. Um, you know, if the charging case doesn't have a lot of depth, they may not fit. So, but yeah. But that's why you guys have me for. You'd be surprised at how many people are in my comment section. And all they're doing is asking about um, what spin fits for like their particular earbuds or whatnot. So, which is I, totally fine by me. Like, I'm like, that's what I'm here to do. I'm here to help make sure that you guys get the right ones the first time. Because, you know, I don't want you guys, you know, buying the wrong stuff. So, Yeah. <laughs> Would you say either JBL Pro 2, uh, oh, as far as noise cancellation versus Sony, it's close enough that you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. So, yeah, as long as, it, here's the thing that's going to be most important above anything else is just making sure that you're trying out all the different ear tips, Arnish, to make sure that you're getting a really good seal, and then the noise cancellation is going to be fine. So, yeah, you're, you're, you're going to be okay. Trust me on this. It's there. JBL's noise cancellation is solid. So, yeah. I <laughs> appreciate your patience. No, it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> hey, Kings fan, what up, bro? Says my JBL Live 660 NCs just arrived. Uh, my God, where these been my life? Nice, man. Glad you got a nice set of headphones. That's dope, man. And Septian, welcome to the fam. Appreciate you coming through. Sep Dog in the house. Always good to see my guy Sep. But yeah, man. Let's see here. Oh, we got a, another couple minutes left. My voice is getting ready to to go out on me. <laughs> I can feel I can feel it burning. I can feel it burning, man. So I'm like, uh Yeah, it's it's no bueno. It is no bueno. Plus I still got some I got some um I got some family business I gotta take care of as well. I got my mom a new printer. And as you know, with our uh elderly relatives, um it's not like I could just send it to her and she could, you know, set it up herself. So <laughs> so I have to I have to go over there and set up a printer from my mom's but you know i don't mind you know it's another excuse to go over there and visit my mom so i'm gonna bring her her new printer um but yeah she had a she had an old inkjet printer and just it just as, as a former copier and printer technician um don't don't buy inkjet printers unless you really need to print things in color if all you're ever doing is printing out black and white documents get yourself a laser jet printer like just do yourself that favor because they use toner they don't use ink and it is a superior tech and it works so much better. Less mess. They last a lot longer. Just take my word for that. But trust me on this. So, <laughs> uh, no, no, no. It wasn't an HP uh, inkjet. It was a um, Epson. And yeah, those things. Yeah. So, yeah. I've been a member in a while. Uh, YouTube payout helped me out a bit. Hey, that's what's up, man. Yo, my guy Rob Hawk coming through with a 1399 super chat. I can't bring up messages for some reason, but let's hit it one time for my guy Rob Hawk, man. It's the money, it's, it's the money, it's, it's the money, yeah. It's the money, it's, it's the money, it's, it's the money, Yo, thank you, man. I appreciate you, bro. Uh, no, definitely not a 3D printer. I would not get my elderly mother <laughs> a 3D printer. <laughs> but no, this is the one I got for her. It's um, it is a, a brother monochrome laser printer. So this is this is the one we're rocking with. It can do photocopies. It can scan, um, and it prints out great. So I actually I've been using a brother laser printer myself i don't i don't have a copier version mine is just a straight printer but it works like a charm so i'm like listen uh and like i said and i used to be a copier printer technician i used to have to repair these things all the way up to the big large machines that they use in office buildings um and one thing i learned is that inkjets cause way more problems 
than than is required. And and then you always have an array fill the different colors. Listen, don't do that to yourself. Most of us are not printing color stuff. So just go black and white. Just like trust me, trust me on this. <laughs> Less of a headache. Less of a headache, man. But yeah, man. <laughs> But that's that's how we're doing it, man. That's how we're doing it today. Let's see here. All right, man. I'm thinking about Brian. So I'm thinking about getting the Soundcore Motion Boom Plus for Christmas. Can't wait to hear all that speaker sound. Oh, dude, the Motion Boom Plus is ridiculous. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So when you get it, um, do this. Do me a favor, right? Find like a corner of your room, right? And kind of like, let's say the corner is like this. Set the speaker up like this in a corner of a room and just let it rip. The, the bass that the Boom Plus can produce is so wild for a speaker of that size is crazy. It's so crazy. So, yeah, man. Enjoy it, man. Enjoy it. That thing is dope, man. Uh, how do we know which spin fit to get before purchasing coming from, uh, I, I'm trying not to butcher your name. Is it Robin? Um, you, you would ask me. <laughs> You could ask me, but you could also go to SpinFit's website. So they do have a, um, I, I will actually give them a little bit of help on figuring out which which uh, which earbuds fit what, uh, so to speak. So you can actually go to SpinFit's website and they do have a size thing. So uh, where is it at here? Let me bring it up. So if you go to SpinFit's website, you can actually find, it says find your perfect tips right here. So let's say, for example, Let's go here. Let's say theoretically you have a sound core. They have sound core under anchor. So you can go here. You have sound cores. And then let's say theoretically, what do we have here? Uh, the space A40. So you go in here and then they have Omni CP1025. Or let's say you have a set of, where are they at? Uh, maybe AirPods, right? So let's go Apple and then let's go AirPods Pro second gen. They've got the super fine that come with the ear tips and the adapter. So you have that way. So you can use their website to figure out which ear tips fit. If not, the other thing you can do is you can drop a comment in my comment section and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. And I can let you know which ones fit for your application. So um, yeah, I've been using their stuff for a long time, long before I was partnered with them. Um, the medical grade silicone that they use definitely helps with keeping itchiness out of my ears. So it's definitely the way, the way to go. Yo, Taze, man. Good to see you, bro. Appreciate you coming through. Appreciate you coming through. Uh, if you're looking for deals, make sure you check out the video description for this stream. Cause I'm actually heading out here in like four minutes. Um, but I put all the different best deals under 30, under 50, under 100, under 200 and over 200. All of them are linked in the video description. So you can go through that list and see, you know, which ones are right for you, but I got a whole list for you right there, man. Let's see here. Uh, would you say the triple driver setup on some um, some earbuds is a gimmick? On status? No, it's not. On some some IEMs on the market? Yes. On the status ones? Absolutely freaking not. <laughs> Don't get it twisted. So that's the thing, right? There, there was a big gimmick in the IEM market. Not the true wireless market, but in the IEM market where people were just throwing drivers and drivers and drivers at earbuds. And that made people think like, oh, well, it's got four drivers. It's better. It's got five drivers. It's better. And that was a bunch of crap, like to be completely honest, it really was. Um, and that's why some of the best uh, earbuds and IEMs that I've ever listened to have single drivers, but some of them that have dual sound really good. And some of them that have triple sound really good status being one of them. So that's one of the ones where it actually is done correctly. And it actually does bring sound quality to the table in, in, a, in the right way. So it's definitely not a gimmick with status. And mind you, I'm not sponsored by status. I bought my status three ANCs. So they didn't send them to me. They were supposed to, and they didn't. So I bought mine. And if I'm telling you that that's the best, like I'm hundred percent vouching for them. It's because I'm vouching for them because I truly do believe in them. They sound that good. They perform that well. They're very, very good. <clears throat> Aditi, how was your Thanksgiving? Hey man, it was cool. I was just chilling here working. My brother was, you know, he was in his room doing his thing. Uh, last night we went, we got some pizza um and that was it bro like we're you know we're just working man we're just you know that's all we're doing so it was just me me and my brother man we're just chilling uh, let's see here are you going to review the awful magic ones i don't think so that whoever that company is they never reached out to me so it is what it is <clears throat> let's see did you see the one more earbuds on amazon going for eight normally 40 i did not i did not interesting 
But man, don't spend eight dollars on earbuds, bro. There's some really good earbuds you can get right now for twenty bucks from like Soundpeats, from Soundcore. I, the links are in the video description, bro. Like, tr trust me on this. Tr you could spend twenty bucks and get some amazing earbuds today. So eight dollars, like, come on, man. <laughs> We can do better. We can do better. I know you got 20 bucks, bro. Come on, man. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, but since the Motion Bo uh, Boom Plus is on sale right now, instead of getting one, I'm going to try to get two. Hey, let's go. <laughs> oh, man, that's hilarious. All right, no worries, man. Yeah, working on Thanksgiving. That's what it is, man. That's what it is. So um, we're, just, we're just doing our thing, man. But... Um, yeah, with that said, man, that's going to do it for me, man. My voice is really wide. I'm starting to feel really, really burny, so I'm going to have to stop here. But I really do appreciate everybody coming through and hanging with me um, for the stream. Full two hours today. Full two hour stream, man. So, yeah, if you guys have any friends who are looking for headphone deals, do me a favor. Take the link to this video and share it, you know, on your socials if you're on on Twitter, if you're on Facebook or whatever, and you know, friends that are looking to get some deals on headphones and earbuds, um, send them this video, you know, it's got all the links, you know, so people can find exactly what they need. Um, but yeah, you know, do me, do me that favor. If you could, I would really, really appreciate that. Um, but otherwise, um, later on this evening, my guy LaShawn is going to be streaming Holla at your boy. Um, he normally streams at 6 p.m. Pacific time, which is, I believe, 9 p.m. his time on the East Coast. Um, but yeah, and that's just a that's just a stream. They talk about technology. It's not like an earbud specific stream. They talk about tech. We have a good time. We laugh. Hopefully, if I'm feeling well enough and I can get back um, for mom's place in time, I'll be able to jump on that stream as well. But aside from that, I really do appreciate you guys hanging with me. Um, huge thank you to the uh, stream sponsor Tribit um, for letting me go ahead and check out and talk about their uh, the Stormbox Flow. This is a solid speaker for the price. If I can get it to focus, what well, what is going on here? Hello, man, that thing is messed up. Like why why don't you focus, sir? No, no, still don't want to. Look at this. Look at this. why is it doing me like this? <laughs> But you shout out to Trivit for sponsoring a portion of the stream. Make sure you guys check out their speaker down in the video description. But yeah, with that said, man, I'm out of here. Much love to every single one of you. Have a great, great weekend. Uh, we'll be back on Sunday for the usual Sunday shenanigans. So see you guys later. Peace.